Well, babe, Ant-Man and the Wasp. It's good to be. Quantum Mania. Where were you at in your life when this role oh. came along? It was not the perfect place. Mm. I had a show called The Society on Netflix, and we were going in a week. I was leaving. My bags were being packed. I had my apartment, and Netflix cancels it because of COVID. It was so strange. It was like one door closes and another one opens. It's just weird how that went away, and then Ant-Man appeared. It's the universe. You gotta stay positive. Yeah. Do you kind of feel like that was the moment that made you really realize how empowering a moment of failure can be? Yes, absolutely. I think, um, you have a choice. You can get really negative and go dark. And I don't know if Ant-Man would have showed up for me because maybe the universe would think, oh, she's not ready. If this mm. is how she's gonna handle rejection or failure, how is she gonna handle success? You know what I mean? But I really just like looked up at the sky and I was like, okay, I'm ready for something else now. Um, thank you for this. I'm done with it, I guess. <laughs> yeah. And you just have to let it go. You have to let things go. Nothing is permanent anyways.